but why? <laughs> why? <laughs> do they call male servers baristas? Yes, they do. What else? What would I be? A bro Rista? Five Dragonites? Isn't that a little bit overkill? Isn't that like a little bit overkill? Only a little bit, right? <laughs> Your coins looking pretty good. I mean, I gotta get a Shell Smash off and fight the Mewtwo. Actually, I have a dream, right? So what I want to do is... Uh, so, like, there's conventions, right? I was talking about cosplaying. I want to do this. You're not allowed to do this. Do not say that I did this. Um, but this is something I want to do. And uh, I don't think I get in that much trouble for doing this anymore. But you couldn't, I couldn't do that when I worked there. Uh, but, so this is the thing. So, like, uh, there's a convention center, right? Uh, it's called the Sacramento Convention Center, where they have, like, Sac Anime Conventions and other big conventions. And inside the convention center is a Starbucks. And those employees aren't Starbucks employees. They're convention center employees that have been trained to do Starbucks work. Same way, you know, when you go to, like, a Safeway or a Target, those are not Starbucks workers. Those are Target and Safeway workers that are hired to do that job. And they're taught the job by other people who, back, like, ten years ago, were taught it by Starbucks. Those people are not baristas. They do not count. They do not know how to make the drinks. They get sent a book that says how to do it, but they're not taught by anyone. Like, they're just not, right? What do we want to do here? I'll finish my story in a sec. I'm just going to thunderwave this guy. Um, so anyways, uh, you know, all those people, all these people that work at this uh, convention center are not Starbucks people. And so every convention, you know, there gets to be a line of like 30, 40 people. And uh, there gets to be a line of like 30, 40 people. And so... What I want to do is put on, like, one of my Starbucks shirts. I have a ton of them. Put on my apron and, uh, you know, go start, like, probably 10 people down the line. Have, like, a notebook and be like, you know, um, yeah, hey, can I get your order? You know, like, it looks like, you know, like, when you go to, like, In-N-Out or somewhere, like, sometimes the people come out and take your order ahead of time. So I want to take everyone's order. And, like, I, I worked there for, like, five years. So I know how everything works. I'm, like... If they had questions, or like I could say, like, do you want this with that? Do you want that with that? Take everyone's order and go like down the line, like ten or so people, uh, just long enough to where the people that I first started talking to are right about to get to the front of the line. And so when those people get to the front of the line, they're gonna they're they're gonna be like the baristas are gonna be like, so uh, yeah, what do you want? And the guy's gonna be like, I already gave you guys my order. And they're gonna be like, what? And they're like, yeah, the person in the line. And they're like, what person in the line? And everyone, everyone is going to be confused because I obviously worked there. It was obvious. I had the uniform. I know the lingo. Yeah. It's, that doesn't hurt anybody. But it's funny. It's definitely funny. I'm just going to put this up because I can. Yeah. That's my dream. <laughs> I don't know. I, I always think like weird shit like that that I'd like to do. Bamboozle 100. I know, right? Okay. So the reason we set up the light screen is so we can use Coyster correctly, hopefully, definitely, maybe. Like, I could send out any of these things. I think I just send the Coyster out now. And I think I'm just going to Ice Beam this one. Right? Or do I want to set up... I, if I got two shells, so two shell smashes off, I can just win. I think we're just going to ice beam this one. This is okay. Worst case scenario, he sends out like a... You know, a Dragonite that has... Uh, what kind of Dragonite would he send out? That's like the real question. But I don't want to shell smash and have like my stats already like one shot by an Outrage. Because he's just going to send them Mewtwo. And if he sends out like a special attacker Dragonite, I pop the light screen. So that's like why we're still safe here. We're going to try and beat all the Dragonites without shell smashing. That's like what I'm kind of going for. But yeah, but you're like, that's a harmless prank. We call those perfect crimes. And me and my roommates used to play each other on them all the time. That's like a harmless prank you do. And, uh, you know, no one can like prove that like you did it. He does send out the Mewtwo like right now. I think I'm actually just going to go for an Ice Beam. Because I'll live one Psychic. Yo, 91 bits, I'll take it, appreciate it so much. I'll just, I'll just freeze it. I'll just freeze, it's okay, I'll just freeze it. It's cool, no biggie, just freeze. No biggie, just freeze. Freeze it! Freeze it. Never lucky, never lucky, no freeze. It's okay. Like I said, we did not need to even... Like, there would have been a, like, Shell Smash would have been cool, but I'd only be doing double that. And so I wanted to see a little bit about his Mewtwo set before I went into what I was really going to go for. So Starmie's going to switch in on Psychic. Calm Mind, really. 
Super good a dollar to the floor of an outdoor mall. <laughs> that's funny. That see that's like a problem though, cause like someone has to get that off. That's that's not that's a little that's pretty harmless, but you know. I'm gonna go for T wave. Really? The double. He's double dipping on me right now. That's a felony. <laughs> <laughs> it's technically a felony, you're not wrong. <laughs> Alright, um... Let's see, I want to do this. Light screen's, de like, deleted. Hmm. There's no reason to use any of these other moves. Do I even need Star Me for, like, literally anything? This is okay. He can start using Psychic now, and then I'll switch to Beedrill! And Beedrill should be able to clean this one up. I'm not giving up! I can still win this one! Even though this guy's team's busted! How many of those Dragonites you think are speed-natured? Raise your hand. Show, show your hands. I don't know how many of them are speed-natured. Still gonna be hard, though. He has quite a few Dragonites, actually. But I think it's possible that we can uh, get to a situation where we can set up a Shell Smash. This should be able to KO. Even if he Megas. Ah, if he doesn't Mega. Well, we'll see what happens. He should have Megaed a while ago, I think. Are you allowed to use multiple of the same Pokemon? No, you are not. It breaks the rules. Species Clause is definitely a part of the game. But, uh, it's okay. He's finally going Mega. Think he's going X or Y? X gonna give it to me? Why? But why though? You're so like you had a better shot of living as regular Mewtwo. <laughs> huh. I bet if you're making a team of five Dragonites, you're probably not paying attention to nature's. I agree. I agree. That you have the same idea as me. Okay, let's see. Do I need B drill for literally anything? Nope. We're trying to get as many Dragonites as possible before we have to bring Cloyster in. So we're going to test the waters. Like, this is going to do a decent amount. He's going to outrage us right in the face. And I don't think we live in outrage. But that'd be cool. Maybe, like, that was the one that was, like, modest. You know, who knows? That one seemed pretty strong, though. But Starmie should be able to KO with a Psychic here. And then we'll hit him with another one and another one. I feel like he's one of them with a Well, maybe that was the first one. You know? Right? You know what I mean? Like, maybe that was the first one. Hopefully this can KO. I don't know if it will, actually. It's going to be a little bit of risk. If this had Ice Beam, the game would be over. If I had Ice Beam on Starmie, yeah, never lucky. Outrage again. Oof. It's okay. Yeah, I think we're just going to Thunder Wave the next one. And then, hopefully, Cloyster could take out the last three Dragonites. Holy moly, never lucky. We still have Venusaur, too. So we got shots. I think Venusaur can set up on one if we get a para, so like that's what we're kind of planning on doing. So I, I think what I'm gonna do, luckily they can't Dragon Dance. I know, right? Holy moly, that'd be busted. I'm so I'm actually glad Dragon Dance is, isn't in this game. I think Dragon Dance is super busted. So we're gonna Thunder Wave this one, right? Yeah, this one can just hold a Thunder Wave. It'd be cool if we got a para like this turn. That'd be nuts. Maybe he's out of ones that have Outrage. Maybe this one's like a special attacker. Oh, we'll take that. Give me those. Give me those W's. W's all the way to the bank! Let's think about what I should do. Special drop? Never lucky. Okay. I could send out Coyster. If I get a Shell Smash off, I just win. How's that sound? Do I just risk it? Should I just risk it? If I if he gets fully parried, I just win. The game's over. If he doesn't get a full para. See, because Koish is only 70 base speed. Dragonite's in 80. Which means like he should just be faster than me if he's like perfect. It should be should be speed tying. You guys say risk it? Because like you this is for you guys. This is content for you. This is not content for me. Like, fuck, do you think I care about a game versus a five Dragonite YouTube player? I do not. I think it would be funny if he gets paralyzed. And then he could say, like, you only won because of para. <laughs> Go for it, good luck. 
I'll take it. Heart of the cards. Shell smash. Here we go. This guy's probably like, this. See, this, if I'm him, I'm also thinking like this is the one thing I don't want to see is this. Oh, I actually should have waited. I should have sent Venusaur out and let him get confused and Para to try it. That would have been funny. Ah, fuck! It's okay. We're just going to win with my Venusaur then. We're just going to win with Venusaur. That'll be the play. Never lucky. Venusaur versus the world chat. You heard it here first. He's not confused yet. Holy moly, this guy's an absolute beast. Alright. Yeah, we're faster than he is. I'll take an Outrage right now, so I can set the Leech sit up early. There's a Para! I'll take it! Oh, that breaks so he doesn't get confused now, though! Fuck. <laughs> Alright, he still doesn't get confused. That's weird. I don't think he should get confused if he doesn't use the Outrage, but I guess he already or he originally did. I don't know, that's weird. Except for five minutes in Paraly, I miss a 5D19. It's still here! We're fighting it! We're trying our absolute best! If we can end this with a sub somehow, we can actually win. It's gonna be rough. It's not gonna be easy. Oh, I'll take that. I think I can heal with Sludge Bomb from here. I think Sludge Bomb. Oh, yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna end this with a sub! Yo, that's value, chat. It's value right now. Sludge Bomb beatdown right now. There we go, Venusaur. Show him what you're working with, my guy. All right, all right, all right, all right. All right, so this next one's going to be faster than me. So we're going to go, he's going to break our sub, we're going to sleep powder, we're going to take the advantage to leech seed before, and then sub. And I think we can actually, if we hit all our sleep powders and get at least two turn sleeps on all of them, we can technically beat the last two Dragonites. Got to get a little bit lucky, though. Just a little bit. Just a little bit lucky. Don't sub on me. <laughs> Please don't sub. Earthquake! Oh, he's not, even, he's not even going for the outrage. He's mixing it up. That might not. If, I mean, if you're modest, I might get to keep my sub. Damn. <laughs> Alright, can we hit a sleep powder? Survey says. Alright. Alright. I got to speed this up. I don't want to time me. <laughs> got to go fast. And again, like I said, we had a weak seed like right now. Because we can't uh, take time to go for sleep, a sub. It's I know it's not as safe because he can wake up. Actually, he went first. He can't wake up. This is definitely the play. Well, it's definitely acceptable, right? And now we sub. One thing I don't want to happen is him like wake up, hit me, and I sludge bomb poison him. So I got to watch out for that. I got to watch out for that. I don't want to sludge bomb until I'm like, unless I think it'll KO. And then at that point, if I he lives and get poisoned, well, then he's poisoned. Watch this full start time stalling. I mean, I wouldn't be surprised. Wouldn't be the first time that's happened. Subs up. If I can get him to the last Dragonite, um, we should be fine. Alright, so he can technically wake up starting whenever. So we're just going to Sleep Powder here. He'll give, give us two chances to do that. And we have 14 Sleep Powders, so we have enough time. So you would, you do not want a Sludge Bomb right now. If I Sludge Bomb, he wakes up. I don't KO, like, I lose my sub, it's bad. It's much safer. Oh! He switched, he's getting another sleep. No, I'll take this. I don't even care. I don't even fucking care. You can hold this one. Go to bed. That's right. That's, hey, fucking go to bed. We gotta remember that this is the one that uh, has the least amount of sleep turns. The other guy's already been asleep for two turns. So the next one's probably gonna wake up next turn. I PP max these moves. We're gonna be here all day. He switched into that. It wasn't me. I was trying to... Yeah, he thought I was going to sleep... He thought I was going to sludge bomb him. And that's why he's like, Aha! And I'm like, uh-uh. <laughs> mm, mm Not my house. This is beautiful. Yo, it has to happen. Oh, come on! What? A, a leech seed miss? How am I going to hit every sleep powder and miss leech seed? I only got six minutes. You think I got time to be wasting? All right, cool. Wait, what? He's dragon tailing. Because I'm faster than he is. And I'm sassy Venusaur. Why are you dragon tailing? Yeah, see, like, I, I saw that. I saw it, like, well ahead of time. I'm like, the fuck is that? He's doing that to... Oh, he's doing that to get around... That's a smart play, to get around, like, Smeat Potter play. That's actually really smart. Holy moly. What a guy. That's, like, super cool. He's going to outrage me this turn. Damn. That's fucking sick. 
Oh, I don't like that at all. Maybe this one only has Dragon Tail, though. And that's like, maybe I'm giving too much credit. I got a Sleep Powder. He's doing it again! He only has Dragon Tail! Okay, alright. I gave him too much credit. <laughs> okay. Like, Dragon Tail... What other moves do you have? You know? The only thing you want to use is Dragon Tail. Dragon Tail, Dragon Tail. That's a, that's a TV show, right? What was, guys, what was your favorite dragon from Dragon Tales, chat? You might switch this turn. Nope, no switch. And you just let... He's, he's gonna use Dragon Tail every turn, so that's actually the right play is to use sub here. I'm actually thinking about this. Thought this man had plays. Hey, man, I give people credit. The blue one. Alright. I wonder if I should go Sludge, sludge Bomb this turn. You know, I yeah, can't. He doesn't, he doesn't. Yo, no, thank you for the follow. Yami8, I think that is. Thank you so much for the follow. Hope you're having a wonderful night. Dragon's gonna wake up. And, uh, slam! Hit me with the young slam! I don't know if that breaks up. That's, like, weak. You're weak! Damn. Damn. Never lucky. Wait, I'm, so I'm just faster than he is. He's sassy! He's, like, the same speed-reduced nature as me! I really want to end this with a sub up. So I gotta, I gotta play to my outs. I gotta play to the outs. I could KO him. Oh no! I could just KO'd him! No! He had outrage the whole time! Ah! No! No, no, no! No, 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 no! Oh, that really, really sucks! Oh, that sucks so much! I could have just KO'd you and met it full, but like, whatever. Um, I guess we just have to use Sludge Bomb so we don't die. Oh, that sucks. He tricked, he tricked me! He used Dragon Tail like three turns in a row and then slam Outrage. I feel... I feel tricked! And the last one is Sleep Turns. Yeah, the last one's gonna wake up. He's gonna wake up and pop me in the mouth with an Outrage. The only way we live is like if we get a sub up this turn. And I think he's gonna wake up. Bamboo salt. Ah, oh, buckets. Wait, that just ah. Oh, why is he earthquaking? Like, I I get that, but like, it doesn't KO. Ah, oh, fuck, man. I couldn't. I had to sub though. I couldn't. I couldn't use uh sleep powder. Sleep powder was not it, chief. Like, he was gonna wake up that turn regardless, and he was already asleep. So like, sleep powdering wouldn't have worked. But like, I had to get a sub. Damn, we lost. Oh well. Maybe he'll Dragon Tail. That's why, I, that's why I went for sub the second turn. Damn, I got never lucky. Never ever lucky. Look at that team. Just look at it. Just take that all. Just take that in. Look at that team. Nitto Queen. Reddick. Red Dick. <laughs> look at that Gyarados name. Oh yeah, this is the Mewtwo that only has Flamethrower. It's the Mewtwo with Calm Mind Recover, Flamethrower, and, like, sub. Right? Right? No, it's this, it's this guy. It's definitely him. Yeah, you remember, his name's Flames. Yep. Big Power Up miss? Yo. That's how bats... Power Up is definitely a big miss. It's definitely a big oof when it doesn't make connections. Is he just gonna leave with Mewtwo? No, no TY? No TY? Pace! Is this, uh, Jolteon? That sucks. Uh, I don't have, like, anything to do to fight this. He's just gonna Thunderbolt me in the mouth. I gotta go to Venusaur. Oh, man. I have, like, no check to that Mewtwo at all. <laughs> I just need three Quiver Dances, you know? Alright, um... This is my only play. He might set up a screen. Now he's gonna take a thunderbolt. That's fair. You, at the, I think you gotta respect a cloister, and you don't know if it's gonna be like physical or special. How many people feel they keep fighting the same guys? Uh, I feed, I fight the same people every day. Yeah. And the weird thing is, like, I stream at like different times, so you know, I shouldn't. I should fight different people more often than other people. And even I said I fight the same people every day. I think if I had Cafable, team Cafable's really good. I think he's gonna thunderbolt me here, and I don't know if I care. As weird as that sounds, like you can thunderbolt me, and I'm okay with that. 
go for it, champ. Or you can switch and get a leech seed up, and like I'll take that too. You might switch. I think he's gonna switch to Mewtwo, cause he's like, well, I'm not gonna use Sleep Powder again. Yeah, but I'll take it. I'll take this thing, put a bleach seed in his face. It's a uh, La Lapras. That's fine. That's fine. Leech seeds up. All right. And uh, he's like, what? He stayed asleep. He's gonna get put to sleep. And I'm like, yeah, dude, don't care. Don't care. I'll take a leech seed though. Give him a little bit of health. Back up to full. And uh, let's see. Who do I want to switch to? I'm gonna, I have to save Venusaur so I can fight that Jolteon over and over and over again. If anything, I don't really need this. I think I'm going to send this out and just go for a taunt and then hard switch to Butterfree on the EQ. Yep. I got, I got, I got plays to make, chat. I got plays to make. I'm going to win this one. So he's going to use a, some attack. Megahorn! Physical Lapras! Who, where, is the, where is the physical Lapras Illuminati when you need him? Right? Who, who's the physical, is it Puka that likes the physical Lapras? Holy moly. Oh, man. Yeah, we fought Marvin re very recently. All right, we're going to taunt because I think he's going to switch Nidoqueen Queen in. And, uh, so we taunt, switch Nidoqueen, Queen, and then he's going to Earthquake. I'm going to switch to Butterfree to mitigate that. So show me Nidoqueen. Queen. Whoa, whoa, that's a Nidoqueen Queen name, right? That's a Nidoqueen. Queen. I love Shiny Nidoqueen. Queen. It's such a cool Pokemon. So cool. All right. Alright. And, uh, he's gonna use Earthquake now because, like, he can't use Stealth Rocks, right? So, I don't want Stealth Rocks setting up, but I'll take the free switch. I'll take the free switch. I'll take it all the way to the bank! Here we go. Show me EQ. EQ! Oh, it's like I played the game! I set that up, like, three turns in advance. I sent that out the turn I sent out Venusaur, believe it or not. The turn that I sent out Venusaur was when that was set up. You may think that it was set up you know, after I saw the yawn, and after other, mm -mm, when I sent out Venusaur, I set that up. Never get the shiny no queen. I did not. I did not. Okay, poker friends. Old man, ask it up for work in six hours. Good night, everyone. Uh, Trey, be sure to link your Discord together with your Twitch account so you can use the emotes on there as well. All right. I mean, that was the right play there too, but I still did the right play. I still did the right play. Don't say. Don't act like I didn't. He can't wake up this turn. It is impossible. So I'll just hit him with the bug buzz. I don't even need. I'm not. I'm not even gonna set up right now. The more that we can deny the stealth rocks, the better. I wonder if he's gonna switch in Nidoqueen. Queen, thinking I'm gonna go for like a double switch, cause like he would expect me to switch like Venus or something else. And so if he expects me to switch, he'd go for like a double switch. He's going for the double switch, and I'm like champion. I always say this. I say this all the time, guys. You do not need to switch. If your opponent cannot threaten you. It, like, does not matter. Like, you're good. You're solid. You made it. Are you, are you gonna mega with this? I highly do not... I recommend that you do not mega evolve with that. I could peck... I could technically be fast. Fire Blast! What? Special Gyarados! No, no, no! No, fam! No thanks! Get that out of here. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I don't like that. I dislike. You could go to bed. Uno. Uno mas. This guy's a fire blast Gyarados flame. I know he has flamethrower in Mewtwo. So we'll see. We'll see when he was going to bust it out. When is Mewtwo going to... He's switching. He's switching. Is it flames time? Lily. See, Lily's not... Oh, man. That ain't it, Chief. Mm -mm. It's not it. I'm gonna use Sleep Powder to get one more- I need three Quiver Dances to be able to outspeed that Mewtwo, guys. I need three Quivers! I need three Quivers to outspeed Mewtwo. I could take the KO right now. And then just send out Beedrill. That works. This probably just KOs. If not, I don't think he'll KO me back. Withdraw! He's going for so many switches! Oh, you better not switch in that Mewtwo. Pace. Oh, he's going to switch in there? He hasn't even started his sleep turns, so it's like, I'm actually gonna go for my three quivers. This is- he's he's expecting me to switch so often! Why do people always add echo effect? I don't even know what that is. Alright, oh, uh, we're just gonna quiver. Yeah, he has to be asleep that turn, that's his very first turn of sleep. Oh, hold on.
I think we can get like a mess, like a Discord or a message of some sort, because it's not showing up here. But someone's asking me something. No, it's there. It's showing up. It was just really weird. That was weird. I don't know why it's so weird. We're not battling right now. Alright, I'm gonna use another quiver. Be a third one. Don't wake up! Battle's cancelled, I'll take it. Oh, is this person we just fought? Whatever, I take those wins. Those are my wins. <laughs>